Hello, everyone. Have you ever been to Vietnam? Besides its stunning natural landscapes, Vietnamese cuisine is also renowned worldwide for its fresh ingredients and nutritionally balanced dishes. Today, we will be cooking one of Vietnam's most iconic dishes. Pho, Vietnamese soup. It is typically made with beef or chicken. The broth of the soup is the soul of the dish, aromatic and deeply flavorful. I will show you how to make the perfect pho with beef, step by step. We have two steps to make this soup: making the perfect broth and cooking the beef, then assembling the soup. For the broth, we need beef bones and a piece of beef. You can use different parts of beef. I have chosen a piece of beef shank, then ginger and onion. For the spices, we need coriander seeds, star anise, cardamom, and cinnamon. Black cardamom and cloves are optional. Finally, the fish sauce. I will not add salt because the fish sauce is already salty. You can add a little sugar if you like to balance the taste. Grill the onion and the ginger in a cooking pan until lightly blackened. Grill the spices slightly, starting with the large pieces, then the smaller seeds until lightly golden brown and fragrant. Blanch the beef and bones to remove impurities. Place the beef and bones in cold water and heat until it boils. Remove from the boiling water and drain. In clean water, add the beef, bones, spices, and fish sauce. When it boils, reduce the heat to low and simmer for about two to four hours. If you are in a hurry, you can use a pressure cooker for about forty minutes. Adjust the cooking time according to the beef cut and also the level of pressure that you choose. Beef shank takes a little more time to cook. Now let's prepare the noodles and the garnish: fresh bean sprouts and a Thai basil. Cook the beef balls, thinly sliced raw beef, chili pepper, diced onion, green onion, and the cilantro. Don't forget the lime. Remember, pho is a versatile dish, so feel free to adjust the ingredients according to your preference. To prepare the perfect rice noodle, soak them in warm water for 20 minutes, then drain. You can even store the fresh noodles in the fridge to use whenever you want. When the broth and the beef are ready, separate the broth from the rest. Let the beef cool down, then slice thinly. If you're patient, you can let everything cool overnight. Use the broth and the beef the next day and remove the fat from the top. It will be even better. It's time to assemble the soup. Boil the beef broth and add some beef balls. Add the fresh noodles to the boiling water for just five seconds. In a large bowl, add the cooked noodles, then sliced onion, sliced beef, cooked beef balls, some raw beef. Pull the very hot broth on top, which will cook the raw beef instantly. Add the fresh garnishes on top. Finally, don't forget to squeeze some lime juice to give more aroma and freshness to the soup. Et voilà, this delicious homemade Vietnamese soup is ready to serve. The noodles are perfectly soft and fresh. The beef melts in the mouth. The rich and savory broth combined with the fresh and, and the aromatic garnishes. This magical Vietnamese soup can transport you back to the beautiful rice terraces and the small islands of Vietnam.
If you enjoy this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Come on.